What's going on guys? Um it's Borgie and I'm back with another commentary for Zotic MLG. Um this is the second map to the uh match I uploaded yesterday. First map we won, second map we won. So we did get the win, but the kids cancelled it like I said in the last commentary. So um we didn't get the actual win, but you know, it's still a win to us. Um, I'm not gonna really take wins and losses that seriously if you saw the last video because spring season's almost over. And um we're actually the whole team might be heading to New Jersey for uh, the KOTC event, uh, NJ Halo, or uh, you could call it King of the Couch Tournament, which it really is, I'm pretty sure. The link will be in the description for the tournament if you want to check it out. It's $10 admission for spectators, and it's $10 admission for everybody and spectators. Um, if you want to play, you have to pay $40, which is 10 for the admission, um, $30 for your team's fee for 4v4. It's ten dollars for two v two and ten dollars for the free for all, which I am gonna join. Um, I'm gonna see if me and Relapse, if Relapse goes, because Relapse not definitely going yet, and I still have the XD marks. Um, but Relapse isn't going. M I, excuse me, Relapse may not be going. He has to see um, what goes on. He might be in South Carolina. If he doesn't go, um, one of my friends is gonna sub in for him. So we gotta see what happens there. I really want Relapse to go. He's our, one of our best players, if not the best, as uh, me and DMarks um, kind of agreed on. He, uh, if he goes, we definitely have a better shot of winning. First prize is 1,200. Second prize is uh, 600, I think. I'm not sure. Um, we do want to win. That's definitely what we want to happen. But the main reason I'm going is to compete, to see teams compete. I'm not sure how many pro teams are going to be there, but uh, if there's going to be any pros, I'll meet them. Hopefully a um, little bit of Envious, some Obey, Collapse, uh, Optic. We'll see who's there. If there's some big team, uh, sorry. If there's some big teams there, it'll be kind of cool, you know, get me and Nade Shot and Merc and Foreplay and I don't know. If those big guys are there, it'd be kind of cool. If I met Jcap and stuff, I think I'd freak out. <laughs> I'm not trying to fanboy, but that's meeting like those those guys. It's kind of like meeting like um, Derek Jeter if you think about it. People that take baseball seriously, I take the video gaming esports community as big as uh, as serious as baseball as some people do. Um, now, people ask me like I'm a, I'm a hockey player. I play hockey, and I'm an Islanders fan because I'm from New York. Although the Rangers in New York too. I never understood why there's two New York teams. Is it because of Long Island and the actual state of New York? Like I don't know if that's why there's two teams, but that's what I always thought, and I don't really know why there is. But everyone always expects, if you're a fan, you should name half the roster. Just because I'm a fan of the Islanders doesn't mean I'm going to know half the roster. To be honest with you, I could name like two two players maybe, and that's just because they're like the two best players in the team. Um, actually, I can name really one. Um, actually, no, two. Tavares and DP, but you know, those are just like two players that everyone can name on the Islanders, even if you're not a hockey fan. You hear about Tavares and stuff on ESPN all the time because he's a good, he's a good player. So you don't really need to know your rosters, I guess, to uh, be a fan. I mean, I'm a fan of Optic and stuff. I can name half the roster. Yeah, not uh, I can name the competitive and the sniping roster. Not every player, but I could probably name the biggest names. You guys know, like everyone knows Pred, Midnight, Jewel, Apostle, Merc, Big Timer, Proofy, all them. But, you know, I don't think you need to know all of them to be an Optic fan. Like. It'd be, it's cool if you do, but like I follow esports more than I follow hockey. But uh, back to the main topic, which is events. I don't even know how I got into that. <laughs> but back to the main topic, which is events. There is a 360 Icons event this Saturday, which is June 23rd. Um, it's at 3 o'clock p.m. It's a 547 team event. It's an online event. First prize is 160. Second prize is $80. I really want to do that. Uh, it'd, be, it'd be very nice to. Playing that, if they live stream, you know, get your name out there. If you if you drop some nice kills, get some nice plays, um, play your play your uh, your role, I guess, and you do it well. It'd be cool to see some pro players. You know, if you see if, if Extra is doing the stream, it'd be really cool to see that. You know, and uh, get your name out there to pro players. See what happens. Maybe they'll tweet at you. Maybe they want to scrim with you or something. You never know what could happen from that. I was actually on Envious's channel today, Team Envious. And I was watching uh, Four Plays Pro Scene, which is tips for competitive gaming, like game battles and MLG, which is, I guess, you can consider them the same things. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's a Pro Scene, is like a series where they ex explain, not really explain, they answer your questions that um, 
you inbox them, and uh, it's actually really interesting. There's about 14 episodes so far. I watched all 14. They're really interesting. There's some that you really should watch. The ones you should watch are the gaming accessories one, um, how to cut players, how to deal with um, friends that aren't good, how to leave friends and stuff. Um, there's just some really good commentaries that I've, everyone getting into competitive gaming would benefit from. Now, I'm not saying I'm an experienced ex player in competitive gaming. I just started getting serious this year. You know, I bought A40s, um, um, getting to events with my team. We're all getting pretty serious. Now, if someone on my team doesn't want the same goal to be um, a professional gamer, winning an MLG event title, um, I'm sorry, but if you ever run our team and you don't want one of those titles, um, you're gonna have to not gonna we're not gonna like be a dick about it and kick you off the team. We're gonna say um, basically kick you off the team, I guess. Um, because if you don't want the same goals as us, there's really no point for you being on our team. I'm not saying anyone's like this so far, but we, I haven't talked to anyone yet about this because I just saw it from the Pro Scene series today. And I gotta ask them um, if they all want to be Major League Gaming Pro Gamers, you know? Cause that'd be kind of cool if we were all gamers. We could be a pro team starting from scratch, which would be a great accomplishment for all of us. And uh, it'd be a great thing to uh, explain, you know? It'd make a great, great story. Um, yeah, so two events that we're going to. First event is a team, hopefully is in New Jersey. And Oh, this event is uh, July 21st. Uh, it's a Saturday, and it's in Morristown, I think. Morristown, New Jersey. I'm not totally sure. I don't have the page open right now. Uh, can I check? No, I'll do it later. The link's going to be in the description anyway, so you can just check in them. Hold on, let me just get a glass of water. Alright, sorry. I just spilled it all over myself, too. I'm fucking dumb. Ugh. So yeah, events, you guys. First event as a team. It's going to be pretty insane. Um, of course, I have to bring my parents, so... Um, I'm bringing my parents and a friend. My, uh, I'm not bringing any any girls. No girls to this. This is it's dumb. I'm not going to bring any girls to this event. It'd just be useless. Because a lot of girls now think... Because uh, my Twitter is my personal and my YouTube Twitter. So I tweet about scrimming and I my bio is captain of uh, Zotic Competitive. And uh, they they ask what it is, and I just tell them uh, when they say what is that, I just say you won't understand. And they're just like, oh okay, because I'm not gonna explain to them what I do. Because plus, if I'm trying to get in their pants, I think if I say I'm a fresh, not professional, sorry, if I say I'm a competitive full D player, I think their pants just got like two sizes too small, um, so they'd be harder to get off. If you guys catch my drift on that one. But uh, yeah, I try to keep it. I don't keep it a secret. But if don't, if someone doesn't ask, I don't tell them. Like if, you, if I go see family that I haven't seen in months, they say, "What are you doing now? Are you still playing hockey?" I'd be like, yeah. I'd be like, what else are you doing? Anything? No. I'd be like, I competitive Call of Duty player. They'd be like, what is that? And I'd be like, you know what? Uh, you really can't explain it to you right now. Go check out the channel and see what we do. Listen to my commentaries. Do whatever. And you know, they hear, they see what I do. They see I'm an editor that used to snipe, uh, playing competitive Call of Duty, trying to get my goal of being a professional gamer and uh, winning an MLG event, which would be pretty insane. I hope Black Ops 2 is on the circuit for Xbox. If it's not on the circuit for Xbox, um, I'm not gonna say I'm. I'm not saying I'm gonna buy a PS3. But um, are you allowed to like? If anybody's watching this that knows a lot about MLG events, can you just buy a PS3 controller and sign up for PS3 even if you don't play PS3? I mean, cause what what could be the difference? Like, really, can't you buy like an Xbox 360 controller with like a PS3 like converter or something like that? Isn't there a way to do that? Or am I like thinking about something else? I thought there was a way you could do this. And here's my uh, double kill cam. But yeah, I thought there was a way you could do that. Like, you use an Xbox 360 controller with PS3, which is what I would me up. Sorry, <laughs> I can't talk, guys. It's like one o'clock in the morning again. Um, yeah, but I, I I'd rather uh, use an Xbox controller on PS3. So I'd uh, have a better chance at winning, because I mean, if we really had to, I'd go get a PS3 controller and I'd uh, I'd try to play PS3. I don't have a PS3, so I'd do something else. I wouldn't like borrow a friend's PS3, but I guess we could just play at the event. I mean, you practice on Xbox. I don't I don't think it'd be that much harder on PS3. You know what I'm saying? Um, but here was the last round against this team. They actually held up pretty well this game. I, forgot, I didn't even talk about the gameplay at all. Um, it's me, D Marks, and Relapse. Uh, of course, I'm running around playing um, Slayer. I don't think I get the most kills, but I'm trying to run around killing everybody um, so D Marks can give him some support. They're both running with bomb every time. I think Relapse um, has the bomb the most, and then D Marks is just uh, supporting him, you know, giving him some, covering him. 
and then I'm just running around behind them trying to uh, kill everyone so they have a clear shot and um, I don't know I forgot how we won this one I think I think relapse dies or something I don't even remember let me see either relapse kills them or the timer runs out but I don't remember guys uh, this game is just about over I want to thank you guys for watching uh, follow us all on Twitter follow our twitch for some live streams the twitch is my twitch actually um, subscribe to this channel so you don't miss when our next updates uh, or uploads come out I'm sorry and uh, subscribe to me, subscribe to Relapse, subscribe to everyone so you uh, stay up to date with Zodic MLG. I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll uh, see you next time. This is the shit right here, this is the HLP, and we gon' do it this year. My lifestyle is, my life's childish. I live every day like it's the last and the wild.